Hello folks, we got some uh, pretty crazy news here. So uh, this is uh, apparently out on uh, Monday, uh, if nothing goes wrong. Um, so that would be it's uh, to what day is that? That would be the 16th of uh, January. This should be released. But basically, if you go into from the depth, you can go into Ashes of the Empire, and now you can go to single player and start a new adventure in land mode. So that's pretty insane. Oh no. Okay, we need to stand here. So here we can see we are dying. No material storage. Okay. So we. <laughs> Come on. No, 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 no. Come on. No materials. Okay, okay. We're not dying anymore. Right. So here we are. This is land mode adventure or land adventure yes uh, let's see here how large this resource area is is this da, 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 da. right there is not the, there is no map here can tell well whatever let us do we have like what do we get here we have one hearthstone one electric engine yeah, we need to we need to do like I don't think this is like a proper playthrough of this th of, of the thing, but we of course need to do a like proper playthrough thing. Someone has 500 materials. Oh, that's very little. But I guess we should add some parts up. Someone has okay. We're taking down a little bit here. God, that's a really basic car. I don't know how uh, I don't know how serious uh, this place. <laughs> I like we're just getting into this thing. Um, it's very it's very just experimental. I loaded up the beta test because it is in the beta test, by the way. If you want to try it out yourselves, All right? We don't have loads. Yes, we can add. I have no idea what we actually should get in the beginning here. So uh, sub object modes. Let's just have a. Let's have a little 60 millimeter turret. Kind of, and have it on top of there. And probably no extra. Come on now. It's fine. Okay, good. So then, we should be able to go forwards. Now let's see here. Plane or water mode? I guess we should go with water mode. And there is nothing here. This is not the most stable. This is like a very basic car though. Okay. Uh, man. That's that's one ass car, but well, this is like it's not like the regular adventure mood. In the regular adventure mood, we can be decently stable, but now we need to kind of lock on to the craft and not be in like uh, yeah. We need to do the the shift lock on thing. Yeah, well, I'm kind of thinking that. I suppose we should just go a little bit here and see. I don't know what speeds we can have. Might need to edit this uh, vehicle a little bit. It's oh god, it's too light. Yeah, it's too light. So we're doing one of these retro. F no, 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 no. Armor refit. Change wood to metal. Thank you. And we're going to add a little heavy armor shield slash weight in the front. And I think that will serve us pretty well. 
All right then. Locking on so we have some better cam there. Yeah, yes. We should actually make sure we control this. Or actually not, that sounds a lot. <laughs> and there we go. Do we have any enemies yet? Not so far. Like, to be honest, I'm not completely positive this game mode even works yet, so I guess I'll be wandering a little bit in the desert. One thing I definitely want is I want a little spotlight thing. Not that I need that, but because it looks kind of cool. All right, look, isn't that beautiful? Intensity, light range, should have uh, yellowish lights. Paste that, oh, beautiful. That probably causes more lag than it's worth, but uh, let's go. Yeah, so I'll just travel uh, here and I'll come back if I find anything. Oh man, I don't know if this is interesting, but... <sighs> Okay, I don't know any better way of tilting back. Okay, no, 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 no. Come on. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. <sighs> so there we have it like that. Now I'll just need to... Like that. Yes, yes. There we... Mm, there we go. Beautiful. <laughs> Ooh, we found a little zone here. Uh, it actually has 4,000 materials. So we'll need to gather some here. And as you can see here, there is a increased difficulty warp gate in the distance. Now, I'm not 100% this uh, game mode is even working, but you will find out uh, watching this video. <laughs> but it should work on Monday. So, I don't know. <laughs> Since we can't lock the vehicle and we kind of need to lift it up a little bit to even build on it, I suppose this is how we'll do it. Who knows? Possibly need some weight down here too. Oh, by the way, I, th I think I got an idea. Uh, da -da -da -da. Sticky foot. Clampy foot. Let's see here. Clamping state. Uh, oh no, this is too. I never messed with this thing. Ready to clamp, okay. Sticky foot then. Possibly. We are now stuck to the ground. Who knows? <laughs> Great. Let's begin the renovation. Say hello to the updated vehicle. I don't know if this works. Hopefully it does. We have some missiles. <laughs> we have uh, all the turret. I guess we should probably see if everything works. Whoa. I want to sit in this seat, however. That's a little bit wasteful to waste the firing, but well. Oh no. AI dead what? What What the hell did we accidentally kill, I wonder? Oh, there are? Okay. So we got some enemies, it's working. That's cool. We should be moving over here then. <laughs> Get into the battle. Oh, nothing, now, now something slowed down a little bit. One thing I do kind of, there's something I kind of forgot here. Whoops. Uh, we need to have a friend or foe identifier right here. Might even want a staggered fire module thing. If I can, uh, all right, there we go. Excellent. So we don't shoot ourselves. 
Oh. Yep, there's an enemy. Come on now. Right. Sixteen are idle. Right. Well, this is certainly exciting in a way. I can be unlocked, good. Right, so here we have... We have a Steel Striders plane. Uh-oh, wait. I hope I didn't shoot my missile module. Shoot at you. Ah! <laughs> Apparently we're on the mood harder. Who knows? The needles should be getting to them, right? You, come on. Oh, the decoy seems to be working pretty well. Now you are there. Come on. Maybe we should... Uh, it seems like my missiles are just a little bit too slow. Oh, no, maybe not. And this gun is not optimal. All right, maybe we should... How much do we have? 200? We can't actually, we can't actually afford any of these. Right then. Perhaps, does this have, this has an AI included. Maybe we need to set up a little quick, quick AI, th no. Why? We can't afford an AI, can we? 300, no we can't, okay. Man, they really like to pester me. So, what I, or the only thing we can do is basically see if we can set up this thing a little bit. Warhead arming delay. Let's set it a shorter. Guidance activation delay can be a little bit shorter. Uh, right, like this. APN guidance, boost that up a little bit. Variable thruster, thrust output to max. Uh, add an extra fin there. Copy. Okay, now then. All right. I wanna see, I wanna see if it works a little bit better now. Come on, mate. No way, wow. Yeah, <laughs> I'm ill-equipped for this, but uh, I have to stand my uh, storm it cast, stand my uh, I don't know something. We have like integrated radar. Oh darn! We got an AI hit there. That's pretty bad. No. Oh, I think they got our AI comp our uh no. Not our ammo. Oh darn. Oh, that's right. I can't afford to replace this thing. It's a tiny. <laughs> Just have to slap a little battery on top of there to kind of get us moving. Come on now. Will they not hit? Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh no. They're also super bad at hitting us. To be fair. 
All right, uh, maybe we should change course a little bit. Go through, okay, that direction. They're just not, can we like, it feels like the new missiles are just not, they might just be too long. We're so close distance here. I think we need to like set a lot of them to fins. All right then. We'll just need to, s we'll just need some of them hitting, to be honest. Okay, you're going for this one. They're still having a super hard time. But they're doing super weird circles now. Okay. We might need to go up AP and Guidance. Let's do it to max. Um, guidance activation delay. Yeah. All right then. Come on. And it's like they got launched up and they're so close. And they're moving in so weird ways. We kind of lose them. Ooh, one crashed. It's kind of amazing. I, I hope that was our missiles. Okay, okay, okay. There we go. Oh, so close. Ah, we're ill-equipped for this. Anyways, uh, where were... Did we pick up that material? We saw some material on the map before. I guess we took that. Whatever is that? It's probably a lost missile. Oh, well. Oh, we got them some repairs done. Right. No. I like, god damn it. Why does it's so annoying that fail safes tend to not work when you are steering yourself. There it is. Oh, this compartment is not helping. Right. There we go. We accidentally blocked ourselves a little bit there. Whoops. It feels like it was a while ago, it actually did some damage to us. We seem to have picked up some dead things. Yeah. This might actually... It, it's not dealing damage to us at least. We picked up materials, so we have like 4000 new materials to use as well. Oh my god, they're so lost. Uh, I think we need to change this to... Uh, let's see her. Shape charge. Uh, you're going to be a remote guide. There we go. Mom. Okay, uh, I am now forced to lock on. Uh oh, to the vehicle. I can't get. Something happened, so I'm not free to the vehicle anymore. Okay, I got the lock on. Man. Nope. Okay. Come on now.
Remote guidance. No. They feel actually worse. Oh, here we have a scary one too. You're a little bit slow. Oh yeah, there we go. Yes, more EMP damage. Beautiful, got that one. Alright, that thing is AI dead. That's pretty nice. But I'm feeling like seriously, the, the radar guidance was better. Active radar guidance, it is. Who knows? Maybe we can have a turning thruster. Activation delay. Two seconds, max fuel 20, okay. Wrong, this one. Maybe that works. Yeah, well we had, we had some stuff going on there. So we can probably continue. Wait, are our steering wheels missing? Oh, wrong button, never mind. Well then, I suppose we can go and collect the uh, dead carcass of uh, the, the uh, what was that? Duster? The plane we shot down. Now you come here again. Okay. No. Ah, look, that's a pretty good one. God damn it. If it continues like this, we're gonna be so seasick. Come on, mate. We need to be able to unlock ourselves. We need to kind of go in build mode and like build here and there. It doesn't work. Well. That's probably unres uh, it's probably irresponsible. You know what we should do? We should save we shouldn't save this vehicle. It's absolutely terrible. We should save this slot so we kind of have there. Uh, because I'm uh, I'm of course think thinking in a normal gymnasm fashion that it's probably time we go into portal and maybe we'll meet some other enemy. <laughs> yeah. In any case like, um, if you think this seems like a good idea to make a little serious of straight away, uh, please tell me in the comments if you would like to see a land adventure mode right now as well. Because we already uh, we started on our sea adventure mode. I don't know if, the, if you think that's too much to with two adventure modes going on parallelly. But if you don't think that, um, please do comment <clears throat> that you want to see the... Uh, more adventure mode and basically this little thing continuing um, if we survive this thing because this is of course not a very serious build thing um, but yeah if you want to see more tell me we we'll might do a uh, tandem like double uh, adventure modes going on oh um, while we are going I think we should go to the east see if we got some better gates there and I should say huge thanks to the folks who are supporting the channel, the commissioned officers in the Army of Jimidism. That's Stellar Admiral Elsa G. Canyon, Captain Scobrox, Commander E. Jin, Lieutenant Asteria, Parba Greed, and Tyler Russ. It really helps that uh, you give me so much support. So if you also want to support the channel, you can check the links uh, in the description, jimidism.com slash support, you have all the options. Now back to the rest of the normal video. Um, I guess we should just uh, explore a little bit here see if we get some enemy popping up um, the missiles I'm having they're more set up to be useful against slow targets they're actually the missile set I had on the draconium so that's pretty cool oh another option you know what we could do we could do this uh, we could make this a uh, stream instead so that uh, this will like never be a uh, 
not like a prop like a regular series but rather a live series on twitch that's also an option one could do if you want to see that but i don't know maybe it's too much <laughs> so it's feeling real dead like nothing is spawning and oh i did turn off the game music so for me it's like just really silent and my engines don't even provide a little basic hum so it really feels like extremely lonely going around in this thing here well well i'm really happy that we have the uh, well, control caps lock to lock on the camera so we don't have to suffer the bumpy ride all the time. It's only in battle mode. Of course, we need to set up an AI, but you know, with like 4,000 materials, how much cost this thing? It's already 12,000. But um, I don't know, it feels uh, pretty cheap to start building something advanced than this because I would like larger wheels. Man, we're, we're, uh, we're moving at 24 meters per second. I would expect something to spawn by now as well. Yeah, I'll just found out that we actually, uh, we can afford some larger wheels. So since nothing is happening very much here, we're going to uh, try and get some larger wheels going see if uh, if we can do some shenanigans here to make a little building thing platform possibly who knows oh man it doesn't seem to work well whatever we're just gonna stick well we're gonna make a central access point here Something like this, a three by three little central axis. So I'm I'm basically trying just to do a little new way of thinking when building adventure mood. We're going to be like hardcore. We're not gonna we're not gonna think as much as I normally do on design. Oh, I can't make this too thick. We don't have it. We don't have the materials for that quite yet. Yeah, you probably know by now that I usually think a little bit too much on this sign, even when playing the adventure mood. And this is, of course, not extremely beneficial. <laughs> oh, oh darn, are you kidding me? He came. All right. Wow, okay. Um, we got some hits there. Let's see if we get some more. We need to make sure. We have another thing in coming there. Oh my god, okay, 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 okay. Come on, we'll need to... A little lower down. Or we're missing. No. We just picked the wrong time of being stationary, man. That was really not so smart. Yeah. After taking that damage. I'm not 100% positive we can afford. Okay, we need to... These connection struts, we don't need them. We can use that material for something else. That was gone, okay, okay. So, how much... Uh, da -da -da -da. Five... Drive wheels, five meters. And something like this. You know, drive wheels in the back, cool. 
and then we need some turning wheels in the front. How much cost these wheels? Turning wheels. Okay, beautiful. We can we can afford that. So uh, turning wheels, five meters. There we go. Our engine seems to be damaged here. No. Power generated. Oh, it's our RTG, right? 30 energy per second. Can we afford another one? This costs 700, too expensive. We can afford a small one. Should be able to muster up some more. All right, then. There it comes. Come on, mate. Yes. Got them. All right, then. We'll see if we need to uh, turn around here. Yeah, we need to pick that material up. Now we're not locked to this thing anymore, so that's nice. <laughs> it looks so stupid. Well, uh, it's fun to try this thing in beta test. Uh, please tell me in the comments if you want to see some more and do also like the video if you will. That would be pretty cool. Oh, I think we picked it up. However, Oh, damn. I thought it was kind of... Nothing was happening, so I thought that this is a good place to end. But I saw a plane in the distance. Man, it's so dark. Where are he at? There we are. Okay, come on. Yes. Oh yeah. Oh yes. Excellent. 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 Right. We should uh, pick up his materials as well. We need to uh, get a proper engine too. Uh, we don't have... <laughs> we don't have anything we can call an engine. We just have a sad little RTG. Actually, if we stop this thing and just wait for it to recharge this battery, we'll have so much more engine power. It's kind of weird how they work. Yeah, but we want to get there too. In any case, we're gonna collect this thing. Uh, do like the video and of course, stay tuned to the channel and do tell me, uh, as I said in the description, uh, what you would like to see uh, moving forwards in a little detail here. If we're gonna have double adventure moods or if we're gonna do streams or if we're just gonna stick with our uh, sea-based uh, adventure mood. In any case, uh, thanks a lot for joining us uh, in this little video and I'll see you next time. This is your host, Jim Desmond. We're signing out.